Hey guys, welcome back to On The Fly. The nation's largest free Irish fair takes place this weekend at Harriet Island. And joining us tonight is Colleen Healy, the executive director of the event. And she's brought some friends with her. I know there's beer here. If Tony was here, this would already be gone. But the good news is we'll have time to talk about it first. So the Irish Fair of Minnesota, we're going to have some dancers. Yes. We're going to have some good food. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a lot of family-friendly activities. Yes. Tell us how did an event like this come about? Because it's really all about Irish. Sure. Um, well, it began 35 years ago with a group of friends who thought it was important to um, create an event that would promote and celebrate Irish culture. Here in Minnesota, which you told me earlier, about a third of Minnesotans have some Irish mm -hmm, heritage. Mm -hmm. I'm an eighth Irish. <laughs> that means That's I'm terrific. super lucky. Are people going to be getting lucky at, at this event? Is that like a part of being Irish? Does that well, just come along with the territory? Well, at least we'll have fun. So Irish should know we say that people will have fun if they go. So everybody is welcome to this fair. Do Irish stereotypes bother you at all? Like, are you like, don't try and say, oh, I'm drunk because I'm Irish. Like, is there, is there any... Just stop that of the stereotypes that go on. Um, well, we don't really. I mean, we do have a lot of beer and beverages at this fair, but we we are really about promoting the culture about right. the fair. Yeah, and mm -hmm. I'm I'm excited for some of the really visual stuff, like the dancers and ladies. I just have to mm -hmm. check in. Are are we are we doing okay? We're we're still breathing. Like yeah. maybe maybe a little bending <laughs> of the legs, a little yeah, just to make sure we okay. We don't want any passing out dancers. Um, now this is something that really got my attention: charitable beer drinking. It exists. Now you have an excuse to drink and feel good about it. And Angie's here to tell us a little bit about Finnegan's playing a role in this event. And your beer really does help charity. Tell us about that. Yeah, so we actually donate 100% of our profits to Feeding the Hungry. So every time you drink Finnegan's, you're actually helping to provide fresh and local produce to those in need. Oh my gosh, people who want to drink for no reason will never have to search. You'll always have a reason. reason. <laughs> and you're also doing a reverse food truck. We know yes. food trucks are huge in the Twin yes. Cities, but what's a reverse food truck? Yeah, so unlike other food trucks out there that are actually handing out food and they have, they're serving burritos and burgers, we actually take food. So we actually collect donations. And so we'll be at the Irish Fair all weekend long. Um, we have set a goal for collecting about 10,000 pounds. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so people can uh, feel a little luckier. They can get in touch with their Irish heritage, have mm -hmm. some fun, and also drink some beer. And, of course, it starts today, so it's going to be going through Sunday, so you have plenty of time to go. And I noticed you brought a beer opener. Does that mean we get yes. to crack one of these? Yes, Because Waz I do has had a tough one. day. I do Waz, have Waz one. Waz is new somewhere. on the set. Waz, get in here. I, I, think, I think you deserve a drink. <laughs> it's, Waz. It's been rough. Have a drink either. So so which one would you open? like, the, uh -huh. the blonde or the amber? It's local. Ooh, Finnegan's uh, is local. It's local. Based in Minneapolis. The amber. The amber. Good and do you believe in the, like, kiss me, I'm Irish thing? Sure. Do you share? Can, yes. can Waz? He's had a rough day. <laughs> he's had like, just like a little kiss on the cheek. Just oh, little, on the cheek. Oh, oh, Waz, right. it's your first right, day. Right, Come right, on. There you go. Just one little peck. Okay. One little. All right. Oh, Take this. All is, yeah. God, all right. Get out of here. Oh. Best day ever. <laughs> you guys don't just come for the good food and the fun people and fun kid-friendly activities. Come for a little dancing. As we go to break, we're gonna let you get a performance here from Rink Rinka the Cree, the dancers, one of 13 groups that will be performing this weekend. Be sure to check it out tonight through Sunday. Ladies, take it away. Oh. 